Do you prefer tossing heavyweight? Um, yeah, I would probably a little bit more heavy in the kind of shorter ones. So, this is probably the most important part of the games here, is the actual games. So, nobody running around dressed like moshers, people actually performing. So, this one is the hammer throw. Um, and we also had the tossing of the caber. And we've actually got one of the contestants for the tossing of the caber. And um, we're going to interview her just now. Again, we're here for our webpage, Scottish Words with American Friends. Mm -hmm. And what is your name? Brianna Lowther. Brianna, nice to meet you. And so you took part today in the games, didn't you? Yes, I did. Okay, and um, you're a tosser? Yes, I... Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> I'm nervous. Okay, no, no, you're fine. And how long have you been a tosser for? Um, this will be my third year. Okay. Yeah, this is my first year at these games, though. The puzzle. Awesome. And believe it or not, this is the first time that we've actually seen someone tossing in public. Oh, well, I'm glad you could join us. <laughs> um, and so, uh, tell me a little bit about like, how did you decide in the first place to become a tosser? Uh, I actually, my father does it, so okay. I kind of followed him in doing it. He's been doing it since college, okay. and um, I grew up with it, so. Fantastic. Um, my father was a tosser as well, um, but, uh, you know, he left when I was real young. So, um, so tell me a little bit about uh, the preparation that goes into uh, tossing wood. Uh, tossing it? Mm -hmm. um, it's a lot of, it's a mental game as well as a physical game. Uh, it's just like kind of overcoming the implements themselves because they're all heavy so you have to be a certain strength to be able to mm -hmm. understand the technique and everything but like to get the mind right uh, the right mindset is a very important thing too. From what we've seen earlier on mm -hmm. there are different types of tossing people are tossing thin bits of wood and then there's people that are tossing more heavy wood mm -hmm. um, is that so what what side were you in there are you do you prefer tossing heavy wood? Um, yeah, I would probably a little bit more heavy in the kind of shorter ones. The taller ones are harder to get because it's like the weights disperse, so it's more of a difficult thing to handle sometimes. Mm -hmm. um, but it does depend on the classes you are. Sometimes you don't get the option of like for the women's open, we get a certain weight and then the, and height for the cabers, and then uh, the men's open will get a different one as well. So it's pretty not to be not to sound sexist, but it's it's. It was predominantly in Scotland, a man's game previously. Yeah. What would you say to, to talk to the people of Scotland, what would you say to young women mm -hmm. in Scotland who are aspiring to be tossers? Uh, I'm, go out and do it. It's so much fun. Like Everybody's super nice and it's like a family out here, honest. Like You're competing for yourself, but everybody helps each other so each person can improve themselves. That's fantastic. And um, lastly, um, do you find that you get yourself a little bit of a reputation locally as a tosser? A little bit, yeah. Like when you tell them that, like, hey, like I'm going to the games this weekend, the Highland Games. The the one the the event they notice the most is the caber. They're like, oh, you're tossing a telephone pole and stuff, and they're like, yeah, that thing. Fantastic. So. Well, that's been a pleasure. Thanks awesome. very much. Thank you. I appreciate awesome. it. Have a awesome. great day.